moving forward on this contract to the point where any delay could potentially put at risk all this work. Any delay for any reason could put at risk to the taxpayers who are going to ultimately look to us to make a hard decision, put at risk uh, the ability to, I think, get uh, perhaps even better service at a better rate. Uh, I know um, that there are many people in this room who have concerns and have expressed them about the work that was done by staff. And there's been suggestions that we should, perhaps should delay. I think people recognize, although none in this room, but I'm sure there are those who might recognize that if we were to delay, uh, it could potentially, again, put at risk what we're trying to do. And it would be a backdoor way of not putting it out to bid. So I hope we won't do that. Um, I like the way you've approached uh, what I think is probably some of the more challenging issues, not just residential, but commercial. Uh, that's always been a frustration to me. I believe in the market. Uh, you know, we have other issues out there involving public transportation, which I think we've over-regulated to the point that we've uh, limited service, increased cost, but that's for another day. In this area here, you've tried to work with what you've got, and I think that um, the term of an enhanced, restricted open market it's not perfect, but it's, I think, the best you could do. So at this time, um, I think that, um, that what you provided this board is incredibly thorough. We've had an opportunity to meet with the vendors. We've had an opportunity to meet with staff. I think any delay, especially when you're talking about the fact that we've got a lot of people in this room who are ready to compete. Everybody here, every person in this room is a professional. They're smart. Capable. They've got great companies that have done the job before. So I am confident that we're going to have a tremendous team providing our service when we move forward. But if we delay, my worry, board members, is that even a delay of a week or so could potentially put at risk the time that we've got for the public to input. And then we have to be able to go in January and move forward with our selections. If you think this is a tough vote, wait till January. It, it doesn't get easier. It gets tougher. Every vote's tougher. So if with each delay, again, you, you have challenges with what we're trying to do, and it puts at risk what we want to ultimately have happen at the end of next year, which is a flawless, seamless transition. If there is a delay, and we're the cause of that delay, and things don't work in October of next year, we're all going to hear about it. 